A young man that they say could not be nothing, couldn't do nothing. Amazing, amazing what my God can do. It's amazing, amazing what my God can do. It's amazing, amazing what my God can do. We need to understand that we are a part of something bigger than who we are. It's amazing what God can do. The church should be one foundation. Welcome to a life-changing experience with Evangelist Jerry Thompson. Evangelist Jerry Thompson has a sincere compassion and love for winning souls. The need to go back and reach others has become a passion for Jerry Thompson. He illustrates his gratefulness towards God through the gift of writing and singing that the Lord has blessed him with. May you enjoy the music ministry of Evangelist Jerry Thompson. This is your true Reverend Jerry Thompson. I'd like to welcome you to Vision of Truth Outreach Ministry. Vision of Truth Outreach Ministry is a ministry where nobody becomes a somebody. Today's special message is the Holy Spirit has led me is to pray for Jamaica, land of the free. Jamaica needs prayer today. I know that there are many other countries around the world that are going through the same dilemma. But they taught me as a young boy growing up to the same back home is learn to dance a yard before you dance a broad. Before you can take the beam out of your brother's eye, take the stick, take the moth out of your eye. You understand what I'm saying? So bottom line is that Jamaica is, is a burden to me right now because it's my country. Without Jamaica, there is no Jerry Thompson. So for every last one of you who have tuned in to Vision of Truth Outreach Ministry, I am here only because of the birth of my country. A man cannot be concerned about where he's from to lift it up, to shine a bright light in a dark place, to light a candle. Where is he going to ever be a man? Jamaica, land we love. Mother Teresa would say, the future is not in our hands. We have no power over it. We can act only today. We have a sentence in our constitution that says we will allow the good God to make plans for the future. For yesterday is gone. Yesterday is gone. Tomorrow has not yet come. And we have only today to make him, him, the Lord God, know love and serve him so we do not worry about it we just have to act on it. jamaica we are praying for you we are praying for the land of the free the place that got its independence in 1962 praise god and I am proud to be Jamaican. Today, as I open in prayer, Father, I want every last person to reach out, every last person that's watching this broadcast, to reach out in faith with me, believing on the Word of God, believing that we together can make a difference. If one man, God saved me 27 years ago, and I know that many souls are saved as a result of God saving my soul, and I'm only one man, but together we can make a bigger difference. 
I want you to reach out your arms and pray with me. Say it after me, Lord Jesus. We come in your presence in reference to Jamaica, an island of three and a half million people. By now about four million, even with the killing. Father, we pray right now that your Holy Spirit may be upon this island now, Jesus. Now, Holy Spirit. Now, God. This minute, as we speak together, because your word said, if two or three are gathered together, touching anything, believing, and we're touching this broadcast, the TV front, the face of the TV, the face of the phone, whatever um, tool you're using right now to receive this message, by touching it, you're agreeing together that there be peace in Jamaica. That as I sing these lovely songs, that there may be more love in Jamaica. Hallelujah! That there'll be more peace in Jamaica. That the killing will cease in Jamaica. Father God, have mercy on Jamaica. Land we love. Jesus, remember the children. Remember the elderly, oh God. Remember the helpless. Remember the poor. Remember, Father God, those who are mentally challenged. Remember those who cannot read or write, who are uneducated. Father God, remember our prime minister. Those who are empowered. I pray, Lord God, right now that you may help to convict the hearts of all the criminals. And if killing must happen, that they may turn on each other and not be innocent. Because we live by faith and not by sight. Father, in the name of Jesus, we plead the blood of Jesus. And as we sing these songs, as, I, as you anoint my voice, my heart, to sing these songs, I pray that the gunmen, the drug dealers, the prostitutes, the murderers, the, the, the pedophiles, that they, Lord God, the hearts may be convicted and they may find healing. Healing right now through the blood of Jesus as your servant, Jerry Thompson, who put the gun down over 27 years ago over a Porsche, two minutes to live on Ivy Lane in Orlando, Florida. I want to thank you, God. Thank you for mercy. Thank you for love. Thank you for salvation. Thank you that it is free. These songs that I'm about to sing you, they're songs that are bringing, that have brought the anointing of the Holy Spirit into the lives of millions of people. Wherever you're watching this telecast at this moment, I want you to believe that God is still the God of yesterday. I know that society does not depict that. Sometimes you wonder if God has forgotten his children. He has not forgotten you. He was preparing you all this time for times like this, when you cannot tell who is real. You cannot tell what is real. You cannot tell who is truthful because everything is buried under lies. The truth is so buried, but the word of God can never be a lie. Ladies and gentlemen, we're in perilous times. These are tough times. Jamaica, we love you. Jamaica, I, Jerry Thompson, Bertie Pippa from up a Claridon Bush. Sister Trudy Grandson, love Jamaica. And I love my people. I'm going to bless you with these songs because I see souls getting saved. I see hearts being turned around. Praise the name of Jesus. The first song is a song that I wrote. And yes, when I come back home to Jamaica to live, this will be the song that I'll be coming home with. I'm glad to be home again.
shall kill that he can. Bring it to give him back the fence. Oh, honey. We're all so good, but it's the best of time. Welcome home, son. Oh, y'all love you. We all love you. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, Father, oh, Father, please let me be. I'm so sorry for the things that I've done. I've wasted my days and nights in sin. Now that I'm home, won't you please let me be. Oh, man, he's 
As I was singing that song, Jesus is the answer, I heard a voice in the back of my head saying, Jerry, what about all the things that you've done wrong in the past? And the word that God gave to me and said, in spite of what you were, it is what I say you now are that you are. God has saved my soul. I am now a born again Christian. The old things have passed away and all things become new. He says you must act as though it were, even it is not, because faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. So don't live in your mess. Turn your mess into a message and be empowered by that message. Like a blind man, I wonder so lost and I'm done like a bigger so helpless without God or a son but then my Savior he had mercy Allah and he heard my cry I said oh sweet Jamaica since Jesus passed by since Jesus has by, oh, since Jesus has by, I said, oh, what a difference to make us since Jesus has by. Well, I can't explain it, and I cannot tell you why. I said, oh. What a difference since Jesus is there. All my troubles and times are now left behind me. And no more shall I just linger on. I just want to thank God for his mercy and that his love has lasted Jerry Thompson for so long. Oh, glory. I am looking for a brighter tomorrow. No more tear will dim the eye. I said, Oh, what a difference since Jesus has died. Since Jesus has died. Oh, since Jesus passed by Jamaica. Oh, pass by Jesus. Stop near Jesus. Jesus, heal the broken hearted, restore the whole body. Father God, remove the greed in the name of Jesus. And even though they're overpopulated, food wise, and not enough job, I pray, Lord God. Oh, I said, oh, what a difference. What I said, oh, God, have mercy. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, what a difference. Since Jesus says, Jamaica, Jamaica, help is here. It's not on its way, it's here. Just you start doing good. It starts with you, Jamaica. It starts with you. Come on now. Hallelujah. The old house I'm living in. Uh -huh.
say to you is now that I'm going out there in the prisons doing crime and drug prevention workshops, motivational seminar, visiting the high risk communities where kids are on drugs and, and, and involved in guns and violence. I now show them how to put the gun down. If you've not heard my testimony of why I put the gun down, you need to uh, just go on to visionoftruthtv.com. That's my TV YouTube channel. Just subscribe there on visionoftruthtv.com and you'll hear my testimony of why I picked the gun up, why I put the gun down. I had only two minutes, two minutes to live because a man came to take my life. And when my friend, he missed me by two minutes. And you need to log on and get that story, visionoftruthtv.com and hear the story why I put the gun down. But more importantly, why I picked it up in the first place. I want to tell you, you don't want to miss that because you're going to find out that gunmen are not born, they're made. And you can only acquire that by listening to my testimony as to why I put the gun down. Subscribe to visionoftruthtv.com. That's my TV station that's on YouTube. Subscribe right there. Also, for those who've listened to these songs that I've written, um, try on. It's amazing. Um, it's amazing what God can do. Glad to be home again. Oh my gosh. I'm so glad that God saves sinners. I'm so glad that God takes people like me that are broken and he puts you back together and give you the umption in your gumption to make you function. I'm so happy to be born again, folks. Trust me. It's just a joy to serve the Lord and to sing and to know that he's blessed me so much that he can allow me to reach you and touch your hearts. Praise God. So if you like the songs that you've heard, please have me come into your community to sing at your concert. It's not about money. Honestly, you look after my plane fare and accommodations. Whatever God says to bless me with, you bless me with. Let God speak to you. Because oftentimes, sometimes it's more than what I'll even charge you. And that's what I said, God, you're so awesome. You're looking after my finance and you're allowing me to reach the lost at any cost. So please call me at that number, 647-692-7793. Also, I want you to know if you want me to come and do workshops, motivational seminars, crime and drug prevention workshops, visiting the prisons, speaking to young people in doing workshops in your community. I work with youth gangs, Eminem, NBC, Crew, uh, Shanghai, Crips, Bloods, Jamaican Posse, uh, Triads, you name them. God has allowed me to go in there and reach them and work with them and pray for them and see them through and point them to the way of the cross. Without the cross, life is crosses. But with the cross, through the cross, by the cross, we are born again, saved and sanctified, Holy Ghost filled, water baptized, and Jesus on our mind, and we're running for our lives. Please, call that number. But what better gift to give your family than the gospel of Jesus Christ to change their lives? But if you've done this already, I ask you to still participate by means of allowing 
Vision of Truth Outreach Ministry, yours truly, to sell your property for you. You're hearing correctly. Any property that you have for sale anywhere in the world, we have over 160 countries that we have agents that will sell your property. Also, if you want to purchase property, we will help you to purchase those properties. Also, you're helping this ministry to get guns off the street. Guns, when you get guns off the street, remember the saying, help them now or fear them later. So by giving us your business, you're preventing that from happening. And what do they say? Prevention is better than cure. Please call that number now or just simply uh, email me at jerrysgospel at msn.com and say, Reverend Thompson, I want to participate. I want to help getting guns off the street. I can't go up there and talk to them the way you do because you've been there. So the proofs, oftentimes, the people who can make the biggest difference are somebody who's been through it. Call now, 647-692-7793. And last but not least, please also go on iTunes and get my, pro, my, my CDs. They're only 99 cents. Or Spotify. Also, you can get them right on there. Or go online where you can order online at visionoftruth.com. That's visionoftruth.com. That's my website where you can go and order through PayPal and uh, Amazon. Sometimes in life it may seem that you are alone. But you're not alone. God is with you. Vision of Truth Outreach Ministries, where a nobody can become a somebody. Why? Because I was you, but with a difference. I got involved in drugs and crime and on my way to take a man's life. But I'm one of the stories that turned out good. And I got many stories like mine to bring to you each and every week from around the world. Remember, man's reject is God's project. And who God hires, no man fire. Amazing, amazing what my God can do. It's amazing, amazing what my God can do. It's amazing, amazing.